Hello and welcome to Professional Development Programs. Today I'm going to walk you through an amazing course, a five-week course is starting in January and ending in February that I know you will love because it includes both Moodle training as well as AI tools. So let's get started. First thing, we're going to scroll down until we get to the course. And the name of the course is AI Generated Moodle Courses. We're going to click on it and notice what happens when we do. We get this message, guests cannot access this course, which means that I need to continue. The continue will take me to a sign in. This is how you sign each time, the first time and every time going to use Google and sign in with one of my accounts. And I'm in. It's that easy. Really, really fast. Next, I'm going to take a look at this course. Now, notice I'm here where it is slightly dark, bold black color. That's where I am. Every time I go to one of these, it's going to turn into black. This time, it's not bold. But that's what's going to happen every time I go into one of these tabs. It's going to change the color and that's how I know where I am. Another way of knowing where I am is going to the left here. Notice I leveled up. That's a gaming feature where the more you do, uh, the more you get. <laughs> right, so let's take a look at this left here. That's the course index and it'll show where I am. Notice now I'm under overview and there are two areas here. They're both locked. Lots of things are locked right now. They'll only open on January 4th, 2025. Next, we're going to go into orientation. Now notice this is everything that's available under orientation and now it opened up in the middle. Notice it's synced. The left is synced with whatever is at the top here. But not only at the top, notice if I click on the orientation again, I get everything that's within it. So I don't need to scroll down really within the actual course. I'm going to close the index and scroll down under the orientation, which is compulsory, folks. So you may start right now. It's not closed and it's open. Notice what's here. You'll get information about all these videos and um, information that you will get. Notice here, uh, that's how to navigate the course. And then there is a form here that I'd like you to fill in. Notice you need to do these. And once you do them, you'll get this ticked off and you'll be able to see it. For example, let me go into edit profile. You'll need to edit your profile and there's information here on how to do it. But notice what happens. Let me go back into the orientation. Notice what happens here on the left. Notice now it's no longer a, an open circle. Now it's filled in with a green color. And that's what happens when you do all of these tasks. Most of the tasks, notice, are to-do tasks where you either have to read or you do an activity. So keep that in mind. And if we're talking about course progress, let me go to the right here so you can see uh, there's someone there online right now, the course progress and my progress. If I click on this, this is what I've done. I've managed to view something here. But notice if I go into each of these, it'll take me to the actual activity that I still have to do. Uh, once I do it, I will be able to get a tick. Notice I got another tick. Let me go back into the course. How do you go back into the course? You can go back by going to the overview once again, and that's at the very top. Notice here. And notice now I've got two ticks here, two green ticks on the lovely baby blue color. And that's how you know what your progress is. Let's go back here. We're still under overview. Notice we want to go into orientation. Okay, and scroll down and go through all these activities. Once we get them done, we will be ready for the course. Let's take a look at what's also available right now for you to view before the course starts, the weekly badges. There are weekly badges. 
There is one for the orientation, and then for each of the weeks, there are five weeks, so altogether, six badges, but one certificate at the very end. So you can learn how to save your digital badges by connecting your backpack, and there's a video on that. However, if you've got questions, use the support forms that are available, or they will be available on January 4th. Until then, you'll have to wait. Let's go on to live online meetings. Notice here you get the exact time, at least of the first meeting. It's uh, on Sundays, and if you click on the 9 a.m. EST, you'll be able to check your time zone. Okay, and uh, that's important, isn't it? And then you've got weeks one to five. If you click on that, you'll be able to register for the courses right now by clicking on register and then it'll take you to the link to register. I'm not going to show you that right now. Let you explore it for yourself. So how do we go from here? We're on a page. Well, there are two ways. One is to go here. These are called breadcrumbs. We are on weeks one to five. We can go on to the next one, which is live online meetings and then the course itself was just AI generated Moodle courses and January is the category. All the courses on this platform on integrating technology are based on the months. So there are courses every month and you'll be able to go by the month to check them out. I'll let you do that in the home since this is not connected to the course really. But get back. We're going to open the left again, open course index. And since we are here and we want to go back to the live meetings, we will click on the live meetings here and that'll take us back to the live meetings. Right now we can go to the next one, the introduction week one here, or we can go and view it on the left in the course index, or we can go to the very top and go on to week one introduction or here. So lots of ways you can get lost, but if you do, please go into the feedback in pink and let me know what's going on so I can provide you with support. I'm the admin of this Moodle site, so I'll be able to help. Next, introduction. Let's go into it and see what's available for us right now. Notice there are videos here that you might want to take a look at before, and there's AI tools for educators that you might want to take a look at as well. Get accounts in all of these before the course begins. So as I said, a lot to do before the course begins. We can go back here to the introduction. We can go on the left, as you know, to the introduction here. So there are two ways of doing that. We're going to go this way and you will find the best way for you. So notice, let's close the left here. We are under week one introduction. Notice it is in black, it's not blue. Everything that's blue is clickable. You can't click on this because we're already there. It's not gonna take us anywhere. All right, so take a look at these ways to get acquainted, get an account on Vogue Key. You can start actually, um, but uh, you won't be able to uh, do very much because all of these will be hidden. Well, they, they are hidden, so you can't really see the activities, but you can get these accounts for Voki and DID if you don't already have one. And you can also take a look at teaching perspectives. So if you're curious, take a look at what's blue. Everything that's blue is clickable. You can't break anything, trust me. So just click away. Let's continue with the activities and resources in week two. There, we're leveling up, we're getting there. Uh, and then notice here what you will do by the end of week two, quite a bit. You will be creating a course. Well, you won't be creating the course, the course will be created for you. You just have to request a course on a website called Online Courses for Free. So get an account there. Now, another thing that you can do, and we'll be discussing, well, you'll be trying out, but we will also be discussing different ways of using these AI tools to create a syllabus. They're AI syllabus generator tools, and you can get accounts there. Start thinking about the course that you want to create, because you will be creating a course. 
So it's not just learning about, it's actually creating a course of your own with activities using AI to generate these activities. And then you learn about the blocks. Again, everything that's blue is clickable, so click away and watch the video to learn more. You'll be saving a lot of time if you start now. And then in week four, it's called, notice here, users, badges, and certificates, because that's what you will learn, be learning about. And again, you only get to see a little bit, not everything. And then week five is showcase and reflect. So we'll be using Book Creator, get an account on Book Creator, take a look at it and see what's there. And then certificate of completion. Once you complete all the tasks, you get a certificate. And this certificate, there's a support form that's open there. I will hide it later on because we don't want to start supporting you before January 4th when the course begins. But you'll get a certificate with 30 hours. Your name, of course, will appear there and 30 hours of coursework because you've been working really hard once you finish the course. So looking forward to seeing you on AI generated Moodle courses where you will learn so much. So get ready, rest, take a look at some of these uh, links. Remember everything that's blue is clickable and um, see you on January 4th. Bye for now.